guys i'm here and today we forgot you think this is just a uh, just me watching the video look xbox <laughs> um, uh, this would be kind of fun sorry if the screw is screwed up because since i'm playing since i have the um my, i can't play my computer because unique, my cat. Because he messed it up. Yeah, you can only see games with it unless I do it like this, but I don't know how to just make it up. I'll be off right that guy. Yeah, I found this. I'm pretty sure you can see that. Okay. Uh, I accidentally found the first one. Sorry if you have to watch it differently, it's kind of hard. Um, So, this but name in the top row right there, yeah. I did not create that. It just gave it to me. Don't even try looking it up, trust me. I need it to scold. Yeah, it's the only one that's missing. If I put it right. No, that'd be too far away. Also, I also got all the golden gnomes. Let me just get there. And some of the snow globes. And so if you see like those um trolley things, that means I got all the globes. But this is a hat from it. I can show you guys if they are, but yeah, but I don't probably have to look into points. Okay. To my controller, I'll be like, right. okay, I'm back. So that that, and since I'm using my hand, I have to use my chin to move. And if you want me going on and play, I can't, cause again, I need Xbox gold. And he actually do seems like a snow globe sparkly thing. Tell me, um, also before you just went the way I just you just seen I went, you have to find all 14 in the backyard. And I can show them to you real quick. And the snow globes, they're like the gnomes, but yeah, they but they they can also this is a challenge thing. I'm not, I'm not doing that right yet because I know probably have to look for a YouTube channel to a YouTube walkthrough for that. And see. Here it is. <coughs> All the golden gnomes. You're probably thinking you did not do that legit. And yes, you're right. I did not do that legit. I just want to get all the coins from that, to be honest. Get, uh, when, you, when you do get all of them, and when you... Also, the way to get in here, there's a button right there. <coughs> In maps, like in the uh, maps, you can f if you see those buttons, shoot at it. If you can't shoot at it, use one of your abilities, and you you find a gnome. And okay, I want to tell you something. There's a like the you know, the team vanquish maps, one that has the big bridge that you fall off. If you fall off and shoot the thing real quick, there's a button right there. If you shoot that real quick, you can find a gnome there. And some gnomes are very hidden. I'm just gonna show you the ones in the backyard. And when you get all the gnomes, and also before you see, there's a level thing back there, you have to figure out a password. There, there should be a YouTube channel. I'm not gonna do that. 
I don't know how to massage. It's only oval. And when you get in here, you can play this. Stop the magic. Oops. You get like 6,000 or more from these chests all together. Well, you should get a lot more, but mine fell down. My phone, my phone is sleepy. And, th and that's how you get the set I have right now. I have right there. Well, to even get in here, you have to get all the gnomes with that golden statue is. You have to get all the gnomes to get in the room behind it. And if you do want to find me, we can do infinity. If you don't know what that is, it's the a space time thing challenge that you're able to get legendary pieces. That's how you get legendary pieces there, or you can get the legendary piece. There's two legend there's two legendary pieces that you can get very easily. In the sticker shop shop. If you go on the very back, the last pack that costs like fifty or something. Um you're able to get um, two of them. One of them is the commando corn that I have. The other one is um the the like a pirate imp and yeah, it's very trippy. When you get up close to it, look at it. And for to able to get in here, you have to buy a key from a seagull that costs twenty five stars. Twenty five stars right there. Twenty five stars. Oh, I didn't know I had that much. I can almost get a, a character pack. And for to, for you to get um the the rainbow stars, um the stars that the seagull in the town hall that I was talking about, you don't have to. After you get the key, every time you give him seven stars, you're able to get one rainbow star. So, if you give him seventy stars, you're able. To get ten rainbow stars, and you're able to unlock one of the rainbow star chest. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And the reason that you see the swords, so they like detect any zombie, so any enemy. So if like if someone on the enemy t team does a uh, Plant glitch thing, strips teams and click the character immediately. Yo um so you can tell if he's a bad guy or not. No use for a garment. But it it just sometimes if you're pressing like a pea shooter and you can't tell which one he is, you just have to I don't know. <laughs> it was waiting out here for me the whole time. Oh. Are the bosses dead? Wow. I love it. This very impressive. Yeah, yeah. Well, what's this? Um, I see looking, um, I see looking, um, I see looking, um, I see scratch that. We have a super beam. Not surprised. We had another ball, but I wonder where it went. Oh, that was a fail. Yeah. And 
it, it does the same thing when if you're a zombie. On the zombie with the flags, follow you. Yeah. So I just say in that here. Hey guys, I hope you had a good Christmas. And see ya. Oh guys, look. Jeez, I'm level 80. I never noticed I look lazy. Well, see you guys in the next video. See you guys.